Today I'm back with 25 designer inspired items from Amazon. Now I did a video very similar to this a few months ago and it was a huge hit. So I'm gonna link it right up here if you wanna watch it after this one because there's some really good items in that video, but I'm, I'm back with more. So everything will be linked down below in the description box and also pinned in the comment section by the number you see on screen. So as we go along, just jot down your favorite numbers. I have decided to feature the items by category. So I'm going to start with clothing, followed by shoes, and then handbags and wallets. And then I have some really good jewelry to share with you. And then finally, sunglasses. Up first, we have this Free People inspired two-piece sweater set, which I have shared before, but I just love it so much. And I know so many others are loving it too. And it looks really good with some of the items that I'll be featuring in today's video. And just so you know, many of the items, I would say most of the items in this video are very high-end luxury designer inspired like Chanel, Hermes, Gucci, that kind of thing. Whereas some of the other pieces, like more in the clothing section, are also inspired by brands like Free People, Lululemon, that kind of thing. They're just very expensive brands that people love. Um, and I found some very similar pieces that are a way better price. Next, we have this Skims inspired long tight dress. Now Skims is Kim Kardashian's brand, which is very high quality. People love it. It is very expensive though. So I do think this is a great option if you love this very popular tight dress style. Now with that said, I don't love this. You're, you're gonna see in this clip here, it legitimately is hard to walk in this dress. So I wanna warn you about that. So under the same number, I'm actually going to link this dress I have in beige, also from Amazon, also reminds me so much of a Skims dress, but it's just better quality in my opinion. It's easier to wear and it you can walk in it so much better. So I would say get this one instead. Next we have a Gucci inspired cardigan, which I think is really interesting. Um, it comes in so many colors. So I got the black and they all have the classic red and green stripe or detail that is very, very classic to Gucci. This is just something that I would never in a million years probably buy a real Gucci cardigan, but it's interesting to buy this and kind of experience experiment with it. See if I do like the style. That's what I like to do with designer inspired things. Sometimes like I just legitimately don't want to spend hundreds or thousands of dollars on an item and I'll purchase the designer inspired version to see if I actually wear it and love it. And if I really do, then sometimes that shows me I do want to splurge on the real thing. Here is another two piece set. So it comes with the matching top and shorts. And I love this piping detail around the edges. I'm calling it summer in the Hamptons. It just looks very high end, preppy, kind of luxury, elegant. It's very easy to wear. It comes in so many really pretty colors too. I just went with black and I think this is, is this inspired by Chloe, it's, it is definitely inspired by a high-end luxury brand. If you know, comment down below. Now here's actually a similar style with the piping detail, but this is very similar to the super popular Aloe Streamline bra. Um, it's not a bra, it's like a tank top, crop top, sports bra kind of thing. This is just so popular, very expensive if you go the Aloe route, but this has great reviews. It's really nice feeling and a much better price. Now this really is like a sports bra bra for working out, exercising, that kind of thing. But it is very, very similar to the Lululemon Energy strappy sports bra. So if you've been eyeing that up and don't wanna pay that price, try this first because I think it's great. Um, there's padding here, it's really nice. I love the strappy detail in the back. And of course it comes in many colors. And then this looks very similar to the Free People Haley sweater set. So, I mean, this looks identical. So just buy this instead. The, the Free People version is $100 $30 and this is 50, I believe. But again, it comes with the tops and the bottoms, but I think it's on sale bringing it down to 40 something, which is obviously so much better. Um, it does, you can like wear it as PJs, but the way I see everyone else styling it, I mean, they, they wear it out and about as an actual outfit. This is the last clothing piece before we move on to shoes. And this is not really designer inspired, but I just love it so much. I had to share, I wanna put it in the video because it looks expensive to me. It looks very high end and it comes in a lot of colors that are fun and bright, kind of has like a 70s flair to it with the swirls, but I love it in this neutral colorway. Like it just goes so well together. I think it would be great 
great with shorts or, or jeans, but I styled it with some dress pants. And again, it just looks very elevated. Moving into the shoe category, here are slides that look very, very much like Dior. Also Steve Madden. I have a pair of Steve Madden slides that also look like this. So the Steve Madden ones are 60, uh, 60 or 70. The Dior ones are like almost a thousand. And then these from Amazon are like 30 something. And I would say, get these, they fit perfectly. They are only whole sizes though. So I'm usually a seven and a half or eight. I got an eight. They fit great. They're super comfortable. Um, I love the coloring. I, I just, I love the style of them. Um, so if you're drawn to this, definitely, I definitely recommend them. And then we have these Hermes inspired slide sandals. And at the time of me filming this video, I don't even have them yet. They're supposed to arrive either tomorrow or the next day. And I, I, I ordered them last minute because I thought they would fit perfectly in this video if they're actually good. So I'm going to include a clip of me trying them on in the future. Okay. Future Shay here. I just wanted to quickly give feedback about these Hermes inspired sandals. So I do really like them. I love the coloring of them. Although you can get them in different colors. I think they're really comfortable. The only thing I would say is you can only get these sandals in whole sizes. So I am typically a seven and a half or an eight. So I did get the eight and I do think they work. Like I think they fit me, but they're like right on the edge of potentially being too big. Like I still think I'll be able to wear them, but ideally a seven and a half, I feel, feel like would have been better. It's just, you can't get that. So I would say that's the only thing that I don't love. Here's another option that I will also link under this number. These are also from Amazon. It's like Amazon's own brand, the drop. And I love these. They're not quite as similar to the Hermes, but they are very similar. If you're enjoying this video, please consider subscribing down below. It takes two seconds. It's totally free. And I would love to have you back. Now we're in the handbags and wallets category, starting with this bag that totally reminds me of Chanel with the flat bag design the houndstooth print. I do think it looks a little more fall and winter versus like summer, you know what I mean? But I love the coloring. It's a really pretty neutral color. There is a nice long strap, which I like how it has um, some silver tones and gold tones. So it kind of mixes the metal. So it works with whatever you prefer. I like to mix my metals. There is a little chain strap right here that you can even wear on the crook of your arm. Um, this bag works either shoulder or crossbody. And then when you open the turn style lock, it is a flat bag and there's a nice zipper compartment and a few sections. This bag also reminds me of Chanel. It is a tote bag. It has the nice top handles. It's like a canvas material. Um, and then this is where it looks like Chanel. Chanel is a very, very similar bag to this um, with the chain detail that you can either wear on your shoulder or even just tuck it in like that. It holds quite a bit. Um, I would say if, I mean, if you love this style of a bag and you just think you would use it a lot, you could try it. I don't think the quality is as good as I was hoping. So I don't fully recommend this. If you're looking for like a designer inspired tote, I recommend this one so much more. This is very similar to Dior. Again, it's such a good tote. I love the coloring of it, the pretty like parrot and tiger designs. It's, it's just, to me, it's just so much better. Again, it holds quite a bit. It is like a big tote and it fits easily over your arm. Now this black bag, amazing quality, top notch. I think this looks so expensive, so high end, very designer, kind of vintage in a way as well. It is a, a shoulder bag that you can wear and it actually holds quite a bit. I love the push lock detail on it. You just push it to open it. And then um, it does have an, an additional zipper for extra security. I don't think I would use that. Um, but there is a, another separate zipper inside. It is a smaller bag, but it still holds quite a bit to close it. You just push it in like that. I just love it to pieces. I want to share a Gucci inspired wallet next. And I just want to preface with, I shared this probably three years ago and I loved it. I used it a lot. And then I recently rediscovered it. Cause I kind of had it buried in my closet. My mom was looking for a mini wallet and I was like, I think I have one. And so I found it. I had it in black before, but I gave it to her. She's loving it as well. And when I was kind of putting this video together, I was like, you know what? I want to feature the Gucci inspired mini wallet again 
And so I reordered it in this camel color. It has the smoothest zipper ever. And then when you open it up, it's this glorious accordion style design mini wallet. So you can fit all of your cards, like your credit cards, driver's license, gift cards, whatever. There's a section for coins. There's also a section you can fold up money. And I just love mini wallets because they can fit in any purse. So if you're carrying a huge tote bag, that's fine. If you want to transition to a smaller crossbody, you can just put this in whatever. And this is such a good mini wallet. Okay, we're taking things down just a notch with the, the bags and the pouches, but the Stony Clover inspired pouches and toiletry bags, snack bags. Stony Clover is so expensive and it's really cute. It's kind of, it's kind of, I don't know. It looks very juvenile to me and I used to hate it, but now I kind of think it's cute for certain things. So I have this snack bag from Amazon and it's clear and I love keeping it in the car. We'll take it on vacation. Um, I have a few other uh, toiletry bags, like this says skin, this says face. Um, so I will link all of the Stony Clover inspired options down below from Amazon because the price, again, way better. Moving along to the jewelry category. This is probably my favorite category of this video because I found so many amazing designer inspired pieces, starting with these Chanel inspired earrings. They look very, very similar to the Coco Chanel crush earrings. Um, and so as you can see, they don't scream Chanel like the, the CC stud earrings do, but these are still very well known. So I really like them in the earring style, but I'm also going to link the ring option as well that also looks like the crush ring, Chanel crush ring. So both of those will be linked under this number, but let's move on to another pair of earrings, which are the Cartier Love hoop earrings. I wanted you to see them kind of up close here. Uh, I did get them in yellow gold, but almost all of this jewelry comes in either yellow gold or silver, whatever your, your preference is. And then I also wanted to mention under another number, um, I have talked about this before, but the Cartier Love Rings. And so these are only like eight bucks. So I have the real ones here. Um, I like to stack the yellow gold with the white gold. I love mixing metals, as I already mentioned. Um, you don't have to stack Stack them. You could just get one or the other. Now, I do just want to preface, these are like $8, so they're not going to last forever. I'm sure eventually, I believe it's plated in like 18 karat gold, but after that plating wears off, it's probably going to turn your finger green. So this is a prime, perfect example of if you love some of these items, you should try them, order them at, at the more affordable pricing. And if you love it, if you feel like you keep reaching for it and you're wearing it, then you could consider splurging on the real thing. And then we have this necklace that really looks like an Hermes necklace. I actually got it in an orange color, which is classic to Hermes, but it also comes in a few other colors like black. I think white would be really nice. I do like orange, it's like an interesting pop. I feel like it's, it is pretty noticeable. So I love this. And then I also got this Van Cleef inspired bracelet. So this is something that I have, I've wanted this in the real version for quite some time. And this looks very much like the mother of pearl version. It, it's kind of twofold. This has made me want it more like I really like the way this looks around my wrist. I feel like it would stack really nicely. But if I were to get the real version of this, you can't get it wet. You can't shower in it. You really can't stack it with anything because it, the stones will crack because they're so soft. And so I don't know, the real version is just like not really wearable. Um, this I'm sure isn't going to last forever, but I really like the way it looks. <sighs> and then we have this watch, which just looks again, so high end, so expensive, so luxury. I mean, you can even tell by the coloring of the gold. I mean, this isn't even that cheap of a watch. Like this was $60. So it is like a legit watch. It's just not crazy high end designer prices, even though it looks like one, this would be really pretty on its own, very elegant, sophisticated, or I also love it stacked with other jewelry. Now we're in the sunglasses category and there are so many amazing sunglasses you can find on Amazon at amazing prices. So I'm gonna start with a Gucci inspired pair of sunglasses that, I mean, they look they look so Gucci to me. They're oversized, there's tortoise shell. You can get them in other colors, um, but they look so expensive. They're like under $15. I mean, truly, at this point, I would never spend hundreds of dollars on a designer pair. And then these look like the famous Chloe Celeste Sunnies. I mean, these are just 
so popular. Hundreds of dollars if you were to get them by Chloe. They're very mirrored. You can probably see all of my lighting in front of me, um, but they are like a pink color. They come in other colors. Even in, by Chloe, they come in other colors, but this is the one with like the pink tones that everybody wants. And then we have the Tom Ford inspired Selby sunglasses. So these are, you know, kind of like retro, again, oversized, has the T emblem for Tom Ford along the side. They just kind of go with everything. Uh, very popular, great price point at this. So everything in this video will be linked down below in the description box and also pinned in the comment section. I hope you enjoyed it. Please subscribe if you're new and I'll see you in my next one. Bye.